right, so here he is out of the blue corner, the number one heavyweight contender fighting for the title here tonight. Daniel Cormier has eight championship belts at home. Do you remember, though, the nerves for your first UFC title fight? It's the most overwhelming thing you've ever <laughs> felt in your entire life. You are sitting in the back waiting for that moment where you get an opportunity to go chase something greater than yourself. So many people have played a part in getting this man to the spot. How does he deliver? How does he not let anyone down? How does he ultimately become the champion of the world? This is a big spot for him. He is so excited to try and become the man. Well, self-belief is a powerful thing. He has long thought that he is the best heavyweight in the world. Tonight, he gets a chance to prove it. You ready to fight? You ready? Good. All right, round one underway. This man is all the rage. The Korean Superboy, Duho Choi. Very difficult challenge for the opponent here tonight. This is an outstanding first round fighter. Outstanding fighter overall. But the fight time of the UFC, not a lot, because more often than not, he gets the opponent out of there in round one. Fight behind a nice jab. Oh, you can feel the breeze there. Swing and a miss by Choi. Early connection with the left from the champ. Oh, roundhouse kick lands. Good punch lands. Looks like that one landed. Beautiful body kick. Oh, another stiff jab here. That's about as good as it gets with that weapon. Keep that pressure high now. Trying to go to the body here. Unable to find the target. Way to hide that leg kick. And he lands that side kick. Beautiful jab there. It's one thing to have length. Of course, it's another to use it effectively. Beautiful job with that jab. Oh, single power tie here. Nice shot there by the champ. It's so clear that the guy that's going forward is the guy that's successful. Just over three minutes to go. Leg kick is there. Oh, you talk about mixing the martial arts. Perfect strategy here. Back to his feet. All right, so you got to be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't want to mess around for too long. Oh, got to be careful here, yep. Keep moving those hips until you get your guard back. That was a slick transition. All right, side control now. Yes, smart adjustment, yep. Inside the closed guard now. I mean, he went right into his full guard. What does he do to try to advance himself to give it more of an advantage on the mat? Oh, and there he goes again, working off that beautiful jab. He continues to keep his opponent at distance. I mean, keeps him at bay with that beautiful, precise jab. It is like a piston. It goes in and out, and before his opponent can even realize he hit him, He's already hitting him with another one. Right. I love, love watching this man fight because of that beautiful, educated jab. Let me see that one now. When both are prepared, these are the types of fights that we expect. That leg kick hurt. Well, his opponent seemed to be stunned to a significant extent, but was able to recover, and it's almost like he let him off the hook. Kind of let him off the hook. He needed to really put his foot on the gas to try to find that finish. Stay sharp. Just misses there with the left. 
Oh, is he opened up now? Nasty cut on the bridge of the nose. Now they're trading huge shots here. We'll see who's the last man standing. Five seconds to go here in round one. All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent. Got to be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. Continuing to stay busy here on the ground. Look at that. Recognize he's about to lose position. Hard to get back up again, and he's there. Final seconds of round one. Horn sack for the end of round one. All right, so there's the end of the round. You see the blood trickling down as he makes his way back to the stool. Cut on the bridge of the nose, or so it appears from the strike in that round. Cut man getting right to work. One calf kick can do so much damage. Starting to show some signs of bruising there. It's already starting to limit him. with that one. Well, MMA is a constant exercise in risk mitigation, right? But it would seem to me that if he really goes for it offensively, you can get him out of there. Well, he's got him hurt. He's got him hurt. He's got him hurt multiple times in one round. It looks like this fight should be over by now. But still standing, and I think that speaks to the durability of the guy standing in front of him. Oh, he dove and he lands. Wow. Oh, big shots raining down. Oh, and transitions right into side control. All right, north-south position here. We'll see if the crowd can be mature about this, DC. Joy gets up and decides to take this fight back to his... Oh, nice The Korean Superboy getting absolutely worked here from the top. These are some very effective ground-and-pound strikes. Beautiful ground strikes landed. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. Joy gets caught by the straight punch. position for him here and I can hear Dominic Cruz in the back of my head just screaming about underhooks somewhere. Yeah somewhere. he loved I mean but he's right right he's so right in terms of if you're on your back in the half guard one thing you can't be is flat on your back you need to 
up on an elbow. Right. You need to be half on the side, and you need to control the far side underhook. It is a battle for underhook when you're fighting in the half guard position on the mat. By close guard now. Back to his feet. 90 seconds now to go round two. Oh, beautiful straight right hand. The Korean Superboy got touched there. Another straight punch. Oh, big punch land. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Under a minute now to go round two. Oh, great block there. Oh, big strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he looks to try to chase down that pitch. Big right hand there. Oh, he gets the takedown late in the round here, DC. That could be pretty useful when it comes to the scorecards, potentially. Very useful when it comes to the scorecards, but also a testament to his conditioning and his cardio to still be throwing takedown attempts at the end of rounds instead of winning fresh. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Oh, he just continues to win. pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Gotta be careful. Put him with the jab. Early connection with the left from the champ. Oh, nice jab. Joy gets hit with a kick. That one appeared to land flush. Inside leg kick. Oh, lands a nice straight. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Beautiful body kick. Oh, massive knee up top. Rock'em, suck him out of the shoot here. Nice jab. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Oh, nice right hand. Love champ, yeah. Just over three minutes to go now. What a connection right off the gun. I'm not sure his opponent knows where he is. No, he doesn't know where he is. He's hurt real bad. That punch landed in the perfect spot. Let's work, guys. Under three minutes now to go in what has been a very fast-paced opening round here. Oh, he's got to start kicking. Kicking the body, kicking the head. He's just got to start kicking. Well, I'm no fighter, but if I rock a guy to that extent, I feel like I'm closing the show. Absolutely. You got to go close the show if you get a guy hurt that bad. You cannot back off and take your time. He's right How about these two going at it? Oh, he lands a massive kick here. Well, you can feel that breeze octagon side after the swing and a miss by Choi. So he's really starting to put together some significant body. That's it over the top, and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Beautiful level change, making him think you're going over to fight over the top with that beautiful overhand. Great punch. Beautiful spinning kick lands. That's a brutal cut on his nose there. He is bleeding. Big shot to the head. 90 seconds now to go in the round. Another strike to the head lands.
that punch no good. Both guys appeared to land there. Under a minute now to go in round one. Oh, brilliant execution. Oh, he hurt him again. He's got to try to finish here. Inside leg kick and another one for good measure. Nice combination there by the Korean Super Bowl. Nice kick. These guys are going at it. Lands the overhand punch to the head. There somehow his opponent stayed up with I mean, he's still on his feet, but he's not up by much. Under 20 seconds now to go. Oh, tags him with the straight. Nice job there by the Korean Super Bowl. Final seconds of round one. Huge block there. Five. Second round, straight ahead. All right, so the round is over, and you see some obvious bleeding now. Looks like the cut is on the nose. Yes, it is. Cutman will try to get in there and shut it, but of course, as soon as he absorbs a strike this next round, that thing could reopen. Certainly bears watching here moving forward. All right, we got a few clips for you, DC, of all the damage doled out in that round and his eye continuing to be the main target. I mean, he's getting hammered. He is getting hit in that spot over and over again. And because of that, his opponent has gained in confidence, and he is very limited in what he can do in his approach because safety has to be first now. You ready to fight? Ready. Second round on the way. Choi strike there is blocked. Nice job by the defense. Oh, how about that defense into offense, and certainly the reach advantage paid dividends there. Blocks the strike and immediately counters with a straight punch. Man, his sidekick is just killer. You saw it right there. He has a really good sidekick. He's so fast at doing that technique, and there is no tell when he attempts that certain strike. Well, you see him land the jab there. He's got the reach advantage. Might as well use it. Oh, nice. Nice. We got a lot of blood now, ladies and gentlemen. I think my mother just turned off the TV, but every time that area gets targeted, that cut is getting worse and closer, theoretically, to the end of the fight. Yeah, and, you know, when you got a person like this in front of you that is so good at what they do, when you are bleeding like this and the work is showing, you got to try to find a way to stop them. He needs to try to get a takedown or something. He landed it perfectly. Perfect placement, perfect position. What a huge blow in a big moment in this fight. All right, same bat time, same bat channel. You think he's going to look to set up that hook again here? I mean, you can see it, John. You can see him doing it. You can see him sneaking looks to see where that hand is going to be. He's sneaking looks because he's going to find the opportune time to drop that big hook over the top. Well, when you're dealing with a cut like that, it may not be long. Oh, you've got to keep pressing here. Just over three minutes now to go. Takedown defense holds up. Oh, beautiful jab there by Choi. Big power shot there. Big body kick. Any body kick may finish this fight. It does not have to be the top one up the middle. Great commitment to the kicking game. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. All right, so a good series of kicks by him there. He has mixed it up beautifully, I think, on the feet tonight. He is kicking everywhere tonight. He's doing a fantastic job. Oh, connection by him there. His opponent could be out of here soon, DC. He's almost done. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, you don't know whether to run, hide, grab, or wrestle. He's a, he, I mean, he's confused. He's as confused as he was on his first test in elementary school. Yes, smart adjustment, yep. 
Roy gets back up. Well, I'm not sure if I should knock his fight IQ, but it seems like he's sort of playing around here. Feels like the finish is there for the take. Yeah, the finish is there. And he needs to take his time to try and find it. Don't rush. Be patient. And in that patience, you'll find a punch or kick that will put your opponent out. Looks like the cut man to my right is starting to get anxious with all the high volume strikes being landed here. He has really kept his opponent on his heels throughout. He's had him on his heels. He's got him reacting. He's reacting to the fates. He's reacting to the jab. He's reacting to every single thing coming in his direction. He has got to find a way to change the narrative, to change the way that this fight is playing out if he wants an opportunity. But to this point, this boxer has looked amazing. Oh, man, that cut is nasty. The Korean Superboy gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Gotta shore up the defense here, though. Back and forth we go. Nice jab. Certainly showing off some good hands here tonight. Oh, big diving punch lands up top. These ground strikes are just brutal. He hasn't moved on the bottom, and now he's starting to swell after he takes another ground and pound strike. All right, so he's got the ground and pound game going here. All right, half guard position here, DC. You have an extra pop in your step when you talk about fighters working out of this half. Oh, man. I like half guard as a top fighter. I understand half guard as a bottom fighter. Don't want to be there. Right. Very dangerous. But if you are there, you have to be winning the position of the underhook. It opens up so many opportunities for you to either escape or sweep. All right, there's the end of the round. High intensity, high drama. The nose is severely cut up right now. We'll see what the cut man can do to try to maximize these 60 seconds. All right, DC, we got a few clips of the damage done in that round. Can see where things really started to escalate. Yeah, really opened up that cut, John. The blows are just devastating. He's got to get out of the way more. I mean, if this guy won't do it himself, Somebody's got to help him. Yeah. Listen, can I keep taking these types of shots? Here we go. Third round. Oh! Oh, he gets back up, but barely. Look how wobbly he is. Sidekick now. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. Cut is just bleeding like crazy. I wouldn't be surprised to see a stoppage here. So the amount of blood, the amount of blood that is leaking from this guy. It's amazing that he's still standing. He has been beat up thoroughly. Tonight is not going to be his night. Nasty body kick downstairs. Nice. Well, if this fighter gets back to the stool, he's going to get an earful from his coaches. Confidence seems to be abandoned. Yeah, you can kind of see him looking to survive as opposed to... Oh, this could be over soon! All right, close guard now. You gotta be careful, though. He's got a lot of submissions off his back. Choi's looking to go from the full to the half guard here. Opponent not having it. He has done such a great job of targeting that cut that now he has an opponent in a critical situation. All right, we'll see if he can apply pressure inside his opponent's guard here, DC. Well, he's worked very hard on this part of his game, and these ground strikes are really starting to take their toll. A beautiful fight instinct there as he reverses position. Now he's got the goal. He did a fantastic job recognizing, man. I have got to get on the offense from bottom to top to dominant position. What a great job. Back to the jab now. No good. He gets to the single column time. Look for him to drive and move his opponent to find openings to land that free hand. Take it for a ride. Nice double leg. Nice finish. Well, this is getting hard to watch, and sometimes you hear us say a fighter is too tough for their own good. Anybody want to save this up? Yeah, this is this is a classic case of that. 
where a guy is just too tough. He's not going to win this fight. He may as well throw it. Oh! And that will do it! The Korean Superboy does it again!